The U.S. Army has recently granted Raytheon, a subsidiary of RTX Corporation, a significant contract worth $75 million, approximately $70 million, for the production of 600 Coyote 2C interceptors, directly bolstering its counter unmanned aircraft systems, CUAS, mission. This contract, awarded on January 16, 2024, falls under rapid acquisition authority from the Office of the Secretary of Defense, with all procedures completed within a remarkable time frame of under 30 days following authorization approval and funding receipt. The contract addresses the escalating demand for Coyote interceptors and the consequent imperative to scale up production capacity. The Coyote plays a pivotal role in the U.S. Army's counter UAS system of systems, serving as a radar-guided, rail-launched missile available in both kinetic and non-kinetic variants. It is engineered for deployment across fixed-site and mobile platform scenarios to counteract threats posed by small, low-flying, slow unmanned aerial vehicles, UAVs, and loitering munitions. This endeavor is spearheaded by the Army's Program Executive Office for Missiles in Space, in close collaboration with various entities within the U.S. Department of Defense, reflecting a concerted drive to fortify the U.S. Army's defensive capabilities against unmanned aerial threats. The Coyote, proven effective in combat situations, is a cost-effective kinetic missile variant, launched from rails with a boost rocket motor and a turbine engine tailored for high-speed CUAS operations. It possesses the capability to neutralize both small and large unmanned aircraft systems at greater distances and altitudes compared to similar effectors of its class. Thanks to reduced engagement times, the Coyote can target multiple threats simultaneously, effectively neutralizing isolated drones as well as swarms. In tandem with Raytheon's QRFS, Ku band radio frequency sensor, radar systems, these interceptors furnish crucial detection and neutralization capabilities, constituting indispensable elements of the U.S. Army's counter UAS solution, the LIDS, low, slow, small, unmanned aircraft integrated defeat system. Coyote Block 2 missiles are engineered to counter single drones or swarms of varying size and maneuverability. Raytheon has previously secured contracts for the Ku RFS radar and Coyote interceptors, with these capabilities already deployed in the field. Looking ahead, the projected production requirements for the fiscal period spanning 2025 to 2029 encompass a minimum of 6,000 kinetic Coyote interceptors, 700 non-kinetic Coyote interceptors, 252 fixed-site launcher systems, 25 mobile launcher systems, 118 fixed-site Ku RFS, and 33 mobile Ku RFS, as outlined in a Notice of Intent to Sole Source published on SAM.gov in December. Additionally, Raytheon has developed a reusable, non-kinetic variant, the Coyote Block 3. Last year, the Navy awarded the company a contract valued at up to $147 million to support efforts on a modified Coyote Block 3 for the Navy's future advanced strike, fast, program, with anticipated completion by December 25, 2024. Three years ago, the Pentagon disclosed a $33 million contract awarded to the vendor for work on a Block 3 autonomous strike capability, with an expected completion date of February 26, 2024.